Hello, hello! I am Chef Frenchy and today we are going to do something fantastic. We are making some sea scallop. Coquille Saint-Jacques. So it's going to take a little more time and we're going to have to do a few videos to go tight together. And I have everything ready as usual. We have some sea scallop. We have white wine, mushroom, an egg, shallot, parsley, clam juice, cayenne, tarragon, paprika, lemon, cherry, pepper meal, sweet cheese, and bread corn, pan -leur. And we are going to make, and of course I have those little shells, who are very very good. I have plenty, I buy them on Amazon I think, from a buck or two. Or you can get them at the store if you're lucky to live in the town where you can buy fresh scallop. I cannot, so my scallop will not have the roll, it's just the, the white because uh, in Houston we don't get it. If you live in Seattle you can get all this stuff, it's much better. But here, no. Okay, so right now we are having a little butter on the shallot and a little bit of parsley. And I'm going to make sure my shallot are just perfect, soft a little bit. And we're going to add some mushroom after that, not too much. I have too much because I'm making only one small one, so we're going to put a few mushrooms like this, okay? And let this thing get cooked a little bit. So yeah, this is the fun though, then we can cook uh, and make a video, huh? I was afraid to do it because we never know, you know, and I don't have a, a real kitchen here, but hey, uh, seems to work, right? So during that time we're going to prepare some white wine, I don't need much, just a little bit, like this. And I'm going to put a little bit of sherry, just like this. And we're going to add some clam juice in that mixture. There we go. Now we get some good stuff. The clam juice I buy it uh, like this. Huh? It's a ball, it costs a buck fifty, I think, and it's perfect for what we have to do. Okay, my mushrooms are getting soft a little bit. This is good. My little stove is not very strong, so it takes a little time. But that's the fun, it starts to smell good already, guys. Ah, yeah, yeah, yes. I'm making a very small portion because I'm doing only one, one little uh, Saint-Jacques uh, scallop, and I have four scallops only, so it's going to be a very little uh, little dish. But uh, it's just for a demonstration. It's going to be my lunch, I think. So well, here we go. Huh? So now we're going to add that uh, little mixture we have: white wine, clam juice, and a little bit of sherry to these things and that's why you're going to push your sea scallop into it okay sea scallop you need to make it very 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 quick okay about one minute on each side you don't want them to be overcooked and then when you're going to brawl to melt the cheese on the top you know so we add a little pepper to the mixture a little salt, there we go, put that back there, doing good, we're going to flip them already, it's pretty fast huh, so far, yeah, yeah the little, uh, the little burner there is very good, okay, we don't need that, all right, pretty good huh, so when, when you think your sea scallop are tender enough, you're going to remove it from that little thing. Yeah, we'll keep this one a little bit more. Nice, okay, and there we go. I'm going to put them there on the side. And what I'm going to do now, while I'm reducing this mixture, I'm going to take the mushroom out 
and, and the shallot and everything and put them in the bottom there. Okay, maybe you see I'm making a little bed like this, nice. Oh man, this is smell good already. Okay. Now we put we go to put the sea scallop on the top of this little bed of mushroom, parsley, and shallot. Look at this. Perfect. Now we're going to make the sauce. All right, this is getting good there. We're going to add some cream. Okay, just a little bit to make the sauce. So far, so good. We're going to add the layer. We're going to mix this a little bit. Huh? And reduce it a little bit. We're going to lower the temperature now. We don't want to burn all this stuff. So we're going to add a little cayenne pepper huh? to put a little flavor. Uh, you do it to taste, not too much. Put some paprika. Okay. We go to lower this thing. It's going too fast. Mmm, my my my. So we go to add some tigon. Okay. Quite some tigon, huh? Now I'm going to put a little bit to get a good flavor because this is the tigon sauce that we're putting on the top anyway. Ah, now we start to talk. And now we're going to do a little lemon zest and into it. A little more, I like the, I like the flavor huh? a little bit, it's always good. Alright, this is ready. I did a very small quantity so you see. So now we're going to put the eggs in it. Okay, just the... the, the and mix this, mix this together. Off the heat if you can, it'll be much better. Ah yes. All right, guys. I can stop the. I can stop the. My little stop, we don't need it anymore. I'm going to... I'm going to use a mini... Uh, I'm, I'm going to use... I like to use my tool, you know. So let's go put that little sauce on the top. Right there, like this. Nice to cover everything. See, I did not do much because we do only one thing. Very nice. Alright. Oh my mommy. Okay, now we're going to put some um, some bread corn on the top of the scallop like this. Okay, and we're going to cover it with Swiss uh, Swiss Gruyere. Okay, and during that time you put your oven at 200 on the broiler, and you're going to broil it until the cheese is nice and crusted. You know how it's supposed to look, right? And then as soon as it's finished, we'll come back and I'll show you the, the, the final product. So, the Chef Frenchie, we are back. And look at this beautiful dish we have for you today. Coquille Saint-Jacques, gratiné à la Normande. Um, you see me doing it. The sauce is nice on the heart. And this, I mean, this. Oh man, look at this stuff. Huh? I'm not going to hit it right away, but it's perfect. I have to take a picture before. Thank you very much. See you next week.